Good morning, everybody. Good Tuesday morning. Today is Thursday, September the 12th, 2019, the year, year of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Today's Bible reading, we are in Psalm 74. And again, I'm going to read from the ESV and then from the message. And today's title is, Arise, O God, Defend Your Cause. Arise, O God, Defend your cause. And this is what the Bible says. This is from the ESV version of the Bible. <clears throat> oh God, why do you cast us off forever? Why does your anger why does your anger smoke against the sheep of your pasture? Remember your congregation, which you have purchased of old of old, which you have redeemed to be the tribe of your heritage. Remember Mount Zion, where you have dwelt. Direct your steps to the to the perpetual ruins. The enemy has the enemy has destroyed everything in the sanctuary. Your foes have have roared in the midst of your meeting place. They they set up their own signs for signs. They were like those who swing axes in the forest of trees. In, in all its carved wood, they broke down with hatchets and hammers. They set your sanctuary on fire. They profaned the dwelling place of your name, bringing it down to the ground. They said to themselves, We will utterly subdue them. They burned all the meeting places of God in the land. We did not see our signs. There is no longer any prophet. And there is no, and there is none, none among us who knows how long. How long, O oh God, is the foe, is the foe to scoff? Is the enemy to, is the enemy to revile your name forever? Why do you hold back your hand, your right hand? Take it from the fold of your garment and destroy them. Yet God is my, yet God is my king is from, Yet God, my King, is from, is from of old, working salvation in the midst of the earth. You you divided the sea by your might. You broke the heads of the sea monsters on the water. You crushed the heads of the Leviathan. You gave him as food for the creatures of the wilderness. You split open springs and brooks. You dried up ever. You dried up ever flowing streams yours is the day yours also the night you have you have established the heavenly lights in the sun you have fixed all the boundaries of the earth you have made summer and winter remember this o lord how the how the enemy scoffs and a foolish people reviles your name do not deliver the soul of your dove, dove to the wild beast do not forget the life of your poor forever. Have have regard for the covenant, for the dark places of the land are full of the of the habitations of violence. Let not the downtrodden turn back in shame. Let the poor and needy praise your name. Arise, O God, defend your cause. Remember how the foolish scoff at you all the day. Do not forget the clamor of your foes, the uproar of those who against who rise against you, which goes up continually. Which goes up continually. Now I'm going to read it from the message. And this is what Psalm 74 says, this is from the message. You 
walked off and left us and never looked back. God, how could you do that? We, we're your very own sheep. How can you stomp off in anger? Refresh your memory to us. I'm sorry. Refresh your memory of us. You bought us a long time ago. Your most precious tribe. You paid a good price for us. Your very own Mount Zion. You actually lived here once. Come and visit the site of, of disaster. See how they've wrecked, wrecked the sanctuary. While, while your people were at worship, your enemies barged in, brawling and scrawling graffiti. They set fire to the porch, axes swinging. They chopped up the woodwork, bent, bent down the door, beat down the doors with, with sledgehammers, then, then split them into kindling, into kindling. They burned your holy place to the ground violated the place of worship. They said to themselves, we'll wipe them all out, and burned down all the places, places of worship. There's not a sign or, or symbol of God in sight, nor anyone, nor anyone to speak in his name. No, no one who knows what's going on. How long, God, will, will barbarians blaspheme enemies curse and get by with it? Why don't, why don't you do something? How long are you going to sit there with your hands folded, folded in your lap? God is my king from the very start. He works salvation in the womb of the earth. With one blow, you split the sea in two. You, you made mincemeat, mincemeat of the dragon tenon. You lopped off the heads of, of, of Leviathan, then, then served them up in a stew for the animals. With your finger, you opened up springs and creeks and dried up the wild floodwaters. You own, you own the day. You own the night. You put the stars and sun in place. You laid out the four corners of the earth, shaped the seasons of summer and winter. Mark, mark and remember, God, all the enemy taunts, each idiot desecration. Don't throw your lambs to the wolves. After all, we've been through. Don't forget us. Remember your promises. The city is in darkness. The countryside violent. Don't leave the victims to rot in the street. Make them a choir that sings your praise, praises. On your feet, O oh God, stand up, stand up for yourself. Do you hear what they are saying about you? All the vile, all the vile obscenities. Don't tune out their, their malicious filth. The brawling invective that never lets up. Wow. Well, it just goes to show you. That God does defend himself. He will defend himself. He's not afraid that people don't like him. That's not a surprise to him. He's not sitting there going, Oh my gosh, these people don't like me. What am I going to do? No. God will have his just desserts. God will get justice and vengeance on the people who do not Proclaim his name and give him the glory. Did you know that? God does win. He's won every time and he always will win. There's not one battle that God has God has not lost one battle. And he doesn't and he never will. He never will lose a battle. He will always win. So, so take comfort in that today. Take, take comfort in knowing that God already knows your battle. He's already there. He's already seen it. And he's right there with you. He's right there with you. That is the message for today. So, Heavenly Father, I pray, Lord, that this message, message touches 
Again, one or two hearts. And Father, may you get the glory through this. In Jesus' name, amen. So guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. Smash that like button. Give it a big thumbs up. Hit the, hit, hit the subscribe button. Guys, join the channel. And if you are new to this channel, welcome. 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 And it's, it's amazing. And I do have another channel, which is called Inspirational Messages by Travis. That is my second, that's my second channel. So guys, have a great day. God bless. And remember, you are loved by God. Have a great day, everybody. God bless you all. <music>